Well, hello everybody out there on the internet. This is Real Man Pones, and today I'm gonna make some bacon fried rice with eggs. So I've got my ingredients. I've got my bacon, a half pound of bacon. I think it's a half pound. We'll see. Yeah, a half pound. Got my peas and carrots. Got my uh, mushrooms, which I've chopped into small bits. And I've got my onions and jalapeno chopped up. And I've got my leftover rice from the day before. Along with my soy sauce, some uh, sesame oil, and some sugar. So let's uh, start off with the bacon. All right, here we go. Yeah, listen to that sizzle. That's your mama's doodle hole right there. Uh. So uh, I'll fry that up and I'll get right back with you. Alrighty, now our bacon is pretty much done. So let's uh, get this out and take it out and separate it. We're going to get that grease and let that grease flow to the bottom while we get this bacon up to the top. And then we're going to take it out into another bowl. Get that out. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Uh -uh. Now, you'll notice we have lots of grease left. Now, if you're really health conscious, you probably empty about half of this grease out. But me, I don't give a shit. I'm ready to eat. So, uh, here we go. Now, the first thing we're going to put in there is our onions and hot jalapeno pepper, which I blitzed up in my blitzer. You can chop them up in any size pieces you want, but I blitzed them in my blitzer. And we're going to let those go for, I don't know, three or four minutes to get softened up. We'll get that out, get every little drop, every little drop. So I'll get back with you. And now that those are sweated down a little bit, I'm going to add my uh, mushrooms. Yeah, mushrooms. Mm. And also, I forgot. I've got three eggs, too. Don't forget the eggs. And I also have garlic. So, uh, in case I didn't mention it, uh, I started off on medium high. And it'll stay on medium high the entire time, except for the last two or three minutes of cooking the rice, uh, where I'll lower it down to medium. So let's get these mushrooms incorporated. I've chopped them up, like I said, because I have no teeth. You may want to keep your mushrooms in larger pieces, you know, just sliced. It's up to you. So we'll let these sweat down for a couple minutes and uh, I'll get back with you. Alrighty, now that we've let that, that uh, mushroom sweat down a bit, we're going to add some garlic. And I added it late in the process because garlic can burn real easy. So we want to get it in there just right and I'm not if you had cloves you and slice them up thin you might want to add five or six but uh, since it's all diced uh, three or four cloves will do the, the thing so let's uh, mix these up in here mm, yeah that's what I'm talking about uh, yum All right, now we got that in there. We're gonna add in our carrots and peas. Let's get them all out in there. Mix them up in there. Mm, yeah, carrots and peas. Oh, vegetables. Oh yeah, yum, yum boy, yum. And now we're gonna get our uh, three cups of rice that was cooked the day before and cooled in the refrigerator so let's put that in there don't worry some falls on the floor because you know the mice got to eat too mm, get it all in there all of it ah. mm, 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 mm. so now now I'm going to switch out this big spoon, get it all on there, mm -hmm. and use my smaller spoon. 
because I want to break up the clumps. You know, your, your rice is going to be clumped up after you've refrigerated it. So uh, let's break up the clumps. Yeah, I know I might scratch this uh, Teflon surface, but you know, <laughs> the fans are cheap. You can buy new ones. So it's not really that big of a deal. Let's fry it up. And so we're going to continue cooking this for about four or five minutes. And uh, then I'll get back with you. Alrighty, now we're back. Now let's uh, take a, make a nice little well. Careful, don't want us to go in there. Make a nice little well in the center. And now we're going to take our three eggs that I've beaten and pour them right in there. Oh, get all that good stuff out. Every bit of that out. And we're going to slowly stir it. Slowly. See how that starts to incorporate? And uh, we'll just let that cook a little bit and stir it as we go and uh, then we'll spread it all in. Be right back with you. All right, now our eggs have uh, started to uh, get a little harder and now we're gonna stir in everything, move it all to the center and out, stir in those eggs. You can't have good fried rice without some good ass eggs in there. There we go. Yum. Now we're going to add our quarter cup of soy sauce. Right in there, every drop out. Let's get it all out. Mmm. Ooh, that's salty. Now we're just going to stir it and incorporate that uh, soy sauce into the rice. So we'll cook this another couple minutes and uh, we'll be right back. Alrighty, now finally I'm going to add the bacon back in. And uh, we're going to add a little bit of sugar, probably about two teaspoons full, right in there. Close that up. And just a little bit of sesame oil right here. That's some sesame oil. Not a lot. You can add more if you like it, but uh, just a little bit will do you. And now we're going to stir that in. The bacon fried rice with eggs. Mmm, now that's what I'm talking about right there. This has been Real Man Pones. I'll get back with you to the finished product. There you go, bacon and egg fried rice. Yum, let's get a little bite here, a little carrot, peas, and bacon. Mmm, 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 mmm. That is good, mmm. Better than real man pones with fried rice with bacon and eggs. Mmm, 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 mmm.